اسٹارٹ ہے اعوذ باللہ من الشیطان الرجیم بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم اللہم صلی و سلم علی سیدنا محمد و علی آلہ و اصحابہ و اہل بیتہ اجمعین There is an interesting news in the political scenario of Pakistan that a court has given a ruling against Imran Khan who is the chairman of Pakistan Tehreek and Saaf PTI. So Imran Khan who was the former prime minister right before Shahbaz Sharif the current prime minister and um, the, the ruling goes against uh, Imran Khan and it, it looks very certain that Imran Khan might be disqualified and he might not be able to take part in uh, elections uh, in, in future. Uh, although uh, it's not my topic uh, to comment on politics, uh, I do comment on politics uh, in a philosophical manner and I do talk about uh, the philosophical uh, perspective of uh, politics from a bird's eye view uh, but uh, I do not really comment on the specific um, specific uh, political parties and events and so on uh, but this specific uh, scenario I'm commenting on because um, it falls in perfect line uh, with something we shared uh, about uh, two weeks or so ago, two to, two to three weeks ago. Uh, the, around uh, mid of August, uh, Muhammad Qasim uh, bin Abdul Karim that we all know uh, would, be, uh, would be Imam al-Mahdi in future. And he has been seeing, he has been, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has been talking to him uh, in his dreams and Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, the final messenger of Allah. Uh, Muhammad Qasim has met him as well um, in his dreams, in his true dreams. And most of his, like a lot of his dreams have come true already. Uh, so, so we do have the understanding that he will be Imam al-Mahdi in future, the true leader of the world who would unite the whole Ummah to establish one world government, one Khilafah around the world. So around um, the mid of August, uh, he saw a dream um, and it, it is published on uh, the official uh, channel of Muhammad Qasim and Abdul Karim. You would find the link of, I request my team, uh, Brother Ali, uh, please uh, put the link of the dream uh, of the original video that is uploaded in Muhammad Qasim's channel uh, in the back date. Um, and you would find that in that specific dream, uh, Muhammad Qasim saw that there is there's a passenger plane, like uh, you have the branding of uh, Air Blue, like um, Etihad, Emirates, so on. <coughs> on on the like the plane is branded uh, with uh, with the branding of uh, Pakistan Tehreek and South PTI, Imran Khan's party, and that plane is running on an engine. And off, like Muhammad Qasim sees that engine starts overworking or malfunctioning or something on those lines, and Imran Khan, the name of Imran Khan is written on the engine. So it's symbolically, PTI is the plan, and the engine who's running the plan is Imran Khan, obviously. Next part is interesting, and that is, then the engine stops working, mal malfunctions and finally falls off as well probably i do not um i don't ha have have the aptitude of remembering things uh, precisely i would request you to go refer to the original dream you would find it better over there uh, but anyways uh, uh, to summarize it so happens that the engine falls which could mean uh, multiple things uh, most certain the current st scenario uh, based like uh, like in context of uh, the court's ruling that ha that came today, uh, is uh, is that he might be uh, disqualified and he might not be allowed to participate in the elections uh, in the future. Uh, then, uh, in that context, you would see that the dream of Muhammad Qasim has come true as well. 
uh, there could be other meanings of the dream uh, as well. Allah knows best, and we Allah, we pray to Allah Subhanahu wa Taala that m may may only the uh, slightest uh, possible uh, loss comes. Uh, but it could mean, Wallahu alam, it could mean passing away of Imran Khan as well. Uh, may Allah give him um, health and life. Uh, we, we wish good for all um, friends and enemies. Uh, I don't count Imran Khan as a friend though, uh, but still we wish best uh, for everyone. So, um, so the point is, um, the dream is coming true, but the point is that since it has been established and it is being known that Allah's message has come in the form of dreams of Muhammad Qasim bin Abdul Karim, who is uh, a Qurayshi Hashmi, uh, who is uh, the Ahlul Bayt, like uh, from the progeny of uh, Nabi Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam. The haq has come, the truth has come, truth has been revealed. But we are taking a lot of time to realize it, to accept it, uh, to embrace it. So it is our job to, embr to, 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 to embrace the truth and uh, to accept it with open arms. So Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala blesses us with his mercy and may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala give us the best in the coming times. But if we do not follow the truth that has come from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, then Allah has cleaned, Allah has not cleaned, Allah has swiped uh, many nations before. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala not make us among them.